Hi, this is Bernard from Audio Kinetic. In this video, we'll be looking at the audio file importer that was newly redesigned for 2011.2. I have prepared on my computer a set of files inside a folder that represents the sounds of a car. Uh, as you can see, the files are separated in subfolders. So you, you basically have the engine, the horn, uh, start and stop the engine. So you can import files in WAVs by using the Shift I keyboard shortcut key, uh, by using the context menu, or by dragging the files directly in WAVs. As you can see, all the files present in that folder are now listed on the left area. In the middle area, you see uh, for each of those files what kind of object will be created at the import. For the demo, uh, we'll create an actor mixer object at the top for my car, a blend container for the engine, and the horn. We'll leave it at, as a random container and the two other uh, files will leave them as sound effects. So let's import that structure in WISE. So, so you see a, a complete structure was created in WISE by importing a folder. Building and tuning a blend container for an engine can be quite time consuming so this won't be covered in this video. Uh, I have prepared another uh, structure here that was built prior to this video. So we have our blend container properly set up and also a couple of vol volume uh, adjustments and also some routing here special for this subject. So for the next portion of the video we'll create a new car from the car we created. So let's import another folder structure similar to the one that we imported first. It's called the Ferrari. So I drag the Ferrari folder in WISE and now you see that the Ferrari folder was organized in a similar way than the, the, the first import. So we'll select in the template column here the first car we created. And as you can see, WISE matches the name of the files present in the folder to object in the, in the template. Even if the if the name don't match perfectly, Wise was able to match them using a best match algorithm. Also, observe that there are two additional horn variations that were recorded for the Ferrari. So there's no issue there. They will be added to the horn random container. So let's import our Ferrari. As you can see, the Ferrari structure was created here and you can see the blend container is there. Everything from the first car was replicated to the second car. So that's it. I hope that was useful and see you next video.